This is a brief overview of the SC2 cutter control panel. The power indicator is lit whenever the cutter is turned on. The LCD display shows speed, pressure, and copy count, as well as overall status of the cutter. A typical cutting speed is 500, and a typical pressure setting is 100. However, you may want to adjust these settings for different materials. Currently, the system is showing idle, which means that it is online and ready to accept commands from either the computer or the control panel. While in idle state, you can press the up, down, and left, right keys to change speed and pressure settings. Pressing the local pause button toggles between online and pause states. While in pause, the navigation keys will move the control head across the cutter. Pressing the origin button will set a new origin point, which is where the cutter will start cutting its next job. Press reset to clear the origin point and the cutting head moves to the far right and sets this zero point as the new origin point. Pressing the test button will perform a test cut at the current origin point position so that you can test if the vinyl cuts all the way through but does not cut the backing material. The copy button allows you to rerun the last stored job even if a computer is not attached. This can be handy when you have to run the same cut job many times. Contour cutting is used for peel and stick labels and similar jobs where you want to cut an outline around your printed artwork. Pressing the contour cut key turns on the laser, and when you hit enter, you can use the mark by computer method to align precision alignment marks on your PC. Contour cutting is an advanced feature that is described in more detail in the user manual and other training materials. Please refer to the user manual for additional tips on how to get the most from your SC2 cutter.